Hey folks, welcome to another VR video. Today I'm going back in time again in Pixel Ripped 1995. Now this is one I played back at OC6 very briefly. I played a little bit of one of the levels. Got to defeat the boss and, and move into kind of the 16-bit era. But now we're going to start at the beginning. Here we go. And already you can tell that the sound is definitely a bit more 16-bit than 8-bit. Dot presents how Dot saved the world. There was once a hero named Dot, who was trained by the smartest master. Dot was awesome. Everybody loved her. Because she kept a far off land safe with her super cool laser gun. But Dot was more than just a hero. She was a guardian. Guardian of the very soul of the game world. The Pixel Stone. Of course, the Cyblin Lord is always here to ruin the day. That's exactly what the Cyblin Lord does. Ha ha ha. The world needed a hero. So Dot stepped up. And gave her best shot. Charge attack. And there it is. She got the stone back. And now she's crowd surfing. That's the story of how Dot saved the world. Forever! No, I didn't think it was going to be that easy. It's the beginning of the game. Uh-oh. Poor chicken, just floating off into nowhere. I'm not daydreaming. Of course he's coming to steal it again. Man, I wish I just had a chill time machine like that. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's cool. Here we go. Moving from the Game Boy era to the. Wow, this is awesome. Everything is colorful in 1995, I totally agree. Hey there, it's me, in the mirror. Wait, did I just get- I got a haircut, that's cool! Got my armor. I 
Ah, uh, yes. And my helmet. I feel much more presentable as well. So, in the first game, I was a little girl. In this game, I need to find a new skilled player to help make me unstoppable. So the best player from 1995. According to Player Sync Online is David Keen. All right. David Keen is 9 years old. He's in New Jersey. He has had more hours of gaming than I think his entire life. Here we go. Into the real 1995 was little David. And David has a power system. That's cool. New game. Hey, look, it's me in my room. Hey, hey, Jordan. What you play in there? Uh, don't worry about it, kid. Is that a rip, a dot to the future? It yeah. is. I beat that game like a gazillion times. Okay. You know they're gonna release a new pixel rip game for Christmas, right? Don't tell anyone, but uh, my uncle works at Ultimate, so I got the new Ultimate 32 of course his uncle works at Nintendo I mean ultimate hi way too long he should be back by now oh hey there Mike hi mrs Keen David seriously the day has barely started and you're That's already right. ready on that video game? I am. You don't even know what's inside th that plastic box. People are saying there's radiation leaking from it. Do you know what radiation could do to a growing boy? I do. Yeah, David. Maybe that's why you're so short. <gasps> oh my! You think so? Oh no. I gotta ask the pediatrician about this. Of course. Oh, that's a good idea. Breed hungry frogs. So this level is a bit like The Legend of Zelda. I lost all my little pixels. I was distracted by my mom over there. So we've got awesome rad cats, Marina La Fuerte, Mecha Policeman 2. Rad Raccoon 3. We got a lot of games. Bionite is even coming. I'm gonna take a walk around town and help some old ladies cross the street. That kid's gonna be a bully in the end, I can tell. Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My holiday is good here.
So apparently the Ultimate 32 sounds like a pretty cool console. I'm kind of happy with my power system right now, though, to be honest. Oh man, these guys shoot. Maybe all those annoying beep beeps and pew pew pews are making him go deaf. At least that would explain no. why he never listens to me. No. Doesn't explain much. I just like video games, okay? Gosh. Plus, I am totally listening to her. Right now. Amanda from Finances told me her daughter went bald after playing too much. I uh, can you believe that? Lock and charge your shot, yes, I know. Agreed. Man, I just lost all of my pixels, that's terrible. I get over the here? Said video games can make kids forget how to speak. No. Don't you think David's been a bit too quiet lately? No. Being quiet's great. Ah. What? David! Are you still on that thing? Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, Isabella. I'm going to have to call you back. Okay, David, time's up. Do I need to force you to turn that thing off? That's it. I'm sorry, but I need to protect you from your bad choice. How did that? Oh, what a mess! I did distract the human. Thank you. Hi, Susie. This is Karen Keen. Still keen on finding you a home. I'm just wondering if you've made a decision. Oh, Karen's a realtor. Yet. Oh, hi. Hmm. There's a beautiful garden in the back. Oh, sure. I guess it's diggable. Yes. What do you mean? How deep? <laughs> I'm sorry, what exactly do you need to bury? <laughs> David! I can see you're still playing! Yes, I am. Sorry, I need to deal with something. I'm trying to be nice here, but it's my job to look after you. Oh, but I've just cleaned this room! Ha <laughs> ha! Tormenting mom is great.
Yeah. There you are. What took you so Oh, grand. Come on. How did you end up with a tree like that? It's a nice tree, actually. Oh, you're talking crazy. This, this is the best tree of the lot. Me, that one? Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. There were so many trees. Piece of trivia, I actually have a... Charlie Brown Christmas tree. All year in my living room. David dear, I think your father needs your help fixing up that tree. No, no, no. No need to bother him. He must be in the middle of saving the world or something. I am. I'm glad that the dad knows what's up. Whatever you say, honey. Hopefully we'll get mom to be less skeptical later in the game. Hello, Mrs. Wilson. This is Karen Keene, the realtor who is keen on finding you a home. <laughs> Did you have time to think about that offer? You see, everything you need is within walking distance. In fact, they just opened a new video rental store two blocks away. I know, right? <laughs> you could never have too many of those. I'm glad there's a video rental store. David! The yeah, what's up? The video game is still on? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. I have to go. I'll... Where, where did this come from? Yes, the Pixel Temple key, of course. Head back to town. All right, let's do this. But that's Good. it, all right? Uh, uh, this should go over here. Oh, well, okay, well. Hi, Mr. White. This is Karen Keen. Uh, sorry, I couldn't take your call earlier. What's the matter? Man, these, these darts are more killer than the bad guys. Sure. The neighborhood is very friendly. What? No, 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 not too friendly. It's neutral. It's a, it's a neutral neighborhood. Wow. What? David, come on! Enough is enough! I'm so sorry. I'll call you back later. What? How did this happen? Enjoy your cereal. Those darts are vicious. Vicious killers. Oh man. I didn't forget you, but I need to call someone to finish things in Try there. again. Oh wait. Hello, Mrs. Donovan. This is Karen Keen. I'm glad she has My to call somebody else. Me Whoops. Had some questions for me. Sure, it needs a few renovations, but that's easy. We could change the bathroom tiles, open up a new window in the living room, new carpet for the bedrooms, maybe get a swing set in the backyard. Oh, oh, a tree house. David would love a tree house. Oh, oh, what if I, uh, uh, no. David, how many times do I have to... Oh, darn it. What's that?
Come on. Oh, no. All right, got one pixel. Good. One is better than zero. All right, back on the track here. Hey, honey, where are the rest of the decorations? The expensive ones? They're locked in the closet upstairs. Oh, why are they locked? Uh, I'll go get them for you. Oh, wait, I, I can help! I love how the characters subtly become more challenging as you go. Back in town. Now where do I have to go? I know that's my house. Do I have to go this way maybe? Yeah, there's the temple. There it is, the pixel stone. Why didn't we just leave it locked in the temple? That's not my master. Yeah, of course he has the power of the pixel stone. This is going to be a problem. Okay. Not really sure what to do with this boss battle, actually. There we go, alright. I had to control the controller instead of these weird towers. Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, let's do this. We did it! Defeated the boss. Well, sub boss, of course. It's not the Cyblin Lord. Oh, nice! The Beetle Queen is now not a bad guy anymore. I would love to establish peace with the Beetle Queen. Aw, that's cool! Thank you, Beetle Queen! Oh, that's unfortunate. See, Master thinks the way I do. He also said it was unfortunate. Yeah, that is the pixel rip cartridge. It seems to be a bit doomed. Also, while we're here, I just want to demonstrate some cool things. So, these Game Hero cards are actual people. And my good friend Caleb here who have supported the Pixel Rip family. So I just want to shout it out, look, it's my good friend GT. Gamertag VR as well. Terriel Wood with a hoverboard in the background. How sweet is that? And it's your boy, PSVR Frank, host of the game show. There's some more over here, so I want I want to get rid of this. Uh... Let's see, we got Brian Paul here. I'm actually not familiar with Brian Paul. Hopefully, we'll get acquainted sometime in the future, when the world is uh, a little less crazy. Vivian Chase. I like how the, the lighting kind of changes as you hold the card in different spots. They look great. The game hero cards here. And you're gone virtual. Who's actually in Spain. He makes some really cool stuff. Not just VR videos for YouTube, but also actual VR videos. Kidnapping, identity theft, and now... Okay, so yes, I agree. 1995 games have much darker plots than we're used to. Totally true. Come on, Dot. We need to strategize. So another game hero that's in this game, but not until Chapter 6, is myself, Eric Hartley. This was a quick look at the first chapter of Pixel Ripped. I'm probably going to do maybe a series on this one because I absolutely love the Pixel Ripped games. And 1995 is my jam. Hope you've enjoyed this video. I will be back with more content soon. Until next time, get out there and enjoy some VR for yourself. Pick up Pixel Ripped 1995. Relive your childhood or explore what the 90s were like before you were born in some cases. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.